Hello, Jennifer Tochi here. And, <coughs> excuse me, what? I'm starting up a new series. It's not going to be a weekly series. No, it's not. Because, no. Sometimes I just have too much to do. <laughs> like, in, I'm in the middle of the spring cleaning right now. Because <laughs> it's been so fucking cold here in but Montana. Rainy, 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 rainy. That I haven't been able to leave my door open enough to even think about. It. And then I hurt this. And then I hurt my shoulder. Ha 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 ha. I've been kind of putting off this one because I kind of get yelled at every time I I mention this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I once was singing a song from this group of movies that, and somebody said, "Shh, you can't sing that song. You're not black." I said, fuck you, you don't know me, lady. <laughs> and they are currently in a big tub in my bedroom. It's one of those big fucking blue tubs. Because I have so many of them. And they're black exploitation movies. I love them. Um... I love the era in the 70s. You know, Shaft. That's the song I was singing. Who is the man? <laughs> Shaft. He's one bad. Shut your mouth. <laughs> yes. Mm, I love these movies. Yes. It, uh, and now everybody seems to like have... Of everybody in this town, anyway, seems to have a bug up their butt about these movies. And I have many of them. They're in a tub right now because I'm saving up for a big bookcase to put the rest of my collection in. <laughs> and unfortunately, <laughs> horror takes up so much of my um bookcases that um that I didn't have room for them yeah it's kind of dirty dirty secret I guess yes so I'm gonna review one now maybe two weeks bring another one out yes 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 this one, however, is on a shelf because of who's in it. And oddly enough, <laughs> don't cross your legs and you have the bad knees. Because it has somebody from Police Academy in it. Police Academy Part 2. <laughs> Their first assignment, yes. Calling camp. Let me get my wacky world lounge <laughs> shirt here. Yes. Ebony, Ivory, and Jake. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. And this VHS is... A collector's edition. <laughs> no fancy schmancy colored VHS there. What I love about this one is that it was made the year I was born. 1976. Don't do the math to find out how old I am. Get inside, but yes. 
as you can probably see, it is an action movie. <laughs> probably by this cover. <laughs> yes. And, um, yes, it about, is about, it is about women visiting Hong Kong for the Olympic Games, the Hong Kong Olympic Games. Yes, directed by prolific filmmaker, Sirio Santiago. This 70s classic features a group of traveling female athletes, yes, who are captured from the Hong Kong Olympics and sold as slaves to a group of sadists. Although tortured and beaten, the girls refused to give in to their assailants. Using martial arts and fiery guns, they seek revenge and prove that they can still lick any man ever made. Yes. Every Ivory and Jake. It's Ebony, because Colleen Camp, yes, from Police Academy. She plays Zackleberry's love interest and also motorcycle cop and gun enthusiast partner. And we've got. Oh! Da 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 da! We've got Ebony. <laughs> Specifically, um, Roseanne Caton, who played by her. Her. <laughs> yes. I feel like an idiot now. My, my recording time is running out on the phone. 54 minutes and 26 seconds. Yeah. Um, yes. And she is a Kung Fu expert thanks to her growing up in Hong Kong. And she has a friend from Hong Kong who also knows. Yuck, 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 yuck. Oh, yuck. <clears throat> Karate, yes. And she can also shoot a gun. <laughs> Not so uh, this lady. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> Sylvia Anderson, I believe her name is. Yes. Um. When she gets sold off as a slave. She's ultra into black rights. Yes. Through the whole movie, she's ultra into black rights. And she is sold as a slave in Hong Kong because she won't give in to her captors, just like the other girls. And she says, A hundred years, and I'm right back where my grandmother was. Yes. She's tough, too. And then the friend of the first girl um, is with them. And she is um, from Hong Kong. She is Oriental. So that's how they get the jade part. Although she, was, she is killed off rather early in the movie. And of course, Ivory is Colleen Camp, who spends a lot of time in this movie saying, My stepdad will pay the money that they're asking for and get us out of here. Will he, though? Because the government won't pay the $5 million. But will her stepdad? So she's a little annoying in this movie, but she's part of my Police Academy 
to me. So she can be annoying if she wants. And this is going to go with my police academy stuff. Damn it. She's in more than one movie of police academy. Yes. I think this is a wonderful action movie. These these a lot of these girls in this movie can fight. Especially Roseanne Cooper. Yes. Get your name there. Woo! She can fight. She can kick ass. This girl, mad fights. Yes, it's like she. Oh! Yes. Colleen Camp. Um. Then she comes out fighting, but. Mm, she tries. Yeah. But this is a good revenge movie. You beat me. You. 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 Oh. Sell me off as a slave. I'll kill you, you motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I'm glad that nobody gets raped in this movie. This, because I don't, I'm not a fan of uh, rape revenge movies. So, hey. So, because of the action in this movie... I give this movie a eight point five. Yes, yes. Girls kicking ass, and not because they got raped. Okay. If you get mad at me for doing black exploitation. I'm sorry, but it's a love of mine of movie cinema. Came from the 70s, man. You know? Love, love, love. I'll be doing it every two weeks. Watch it if you want. Don't watch it if you don't want to. Yeah. Okay. For those who will like it, Watch what? Because it'll be coming every two weeks. Unless I go into a depressed mood like I did after after a certain week. Yes. Okay. Yeah, bye.